Yes, Obama, I will call you back later. Okay, no, I really have to go. 4G phones are cropping up like toadstools across the global expanse, and today we're looking at our top five 4G phone picks for InfoSync World. Let's start at number five with the LG Revolution. The LG Revolution is Verizon's third 4G LTE phone, and it is fast as hell. We tested it in Philadelphia, and it was faster than the cabs coming at you at 90 miles an hour. It has a 1 gigahertz Snapdragon processor, 16 gigabytes of memory out of the box, a 4.3 inch WVGA screen, and LG's unique UI, which is kind of a combination of many user interfaces we've seen on a lot of phones this year. We got Netflix, Blockbuster, and overall the LG Revolution was just a solid number five choice. Kicking out the jams, the number four spot is the HTC Thunderbolt, and this is the phone that cracked out of the sky as Verizon's first 4G LTE smartphone. This phone takes the LG Revolution down to Chinatown with its 40 gigabytes of storage out of the box and HTC Sense user interface with Android 2.3. We have an 8 megapixel camera on the Thunderbolt that gave us a great performance, though battery life on Verizon's three super 4G LTE phones is not that great, the HTC Thunderbolt is their most solid option. Sliding in at number three is the Nexus S for Sprint, and this is a phone that we happen to love because we're phone dorks, as you can tell. And uh, this phone is all Google. 4 inch Super AMO LED screen, beautiful curved glass design. It's the size of an iPhone 4 and it has an awesome battery life. One of the best battery performances on a phone we've seen. We get Android 2.3. This was one of the first phones to feature it. 16 gigabytes of internal storage on this bad boy. And we have NFC technology, which is going to allow us to take our phones, swipe it, and pay for things in the near future. The Nexus S definitely earns its spot as the number three 4G phone on our list. And now we're coming into the home stretch. We've got number two, the HTC Sensation 4G, and this is one super power badass mofo of a phone. It has a 1.2 gigahertz dual core Snapdragon processor, 768 megabytes of RAM. This thing runs Android 2.3 and has HTC's latest Sense 3.0, which is one of the most intuitive and pretty user interfaces on the market. We get nine gigabytes of storage out of the box, which is not that great, but we have an awesome eight megapixel camera that gave us one of the best camera performances for a phone we've seen to date. And it has a sexy 4.3 inch QHD screen. The HTC Sensation 4G is definitely a sensational choice. And now it's time for the drum roll. <laughs> Our number one phone is the HTC Evo 3D, and uh, let's talk about this because it's a bit of a controversy for a lot of people. We chose this phone because it's identical to the Sensation 4G except three things. It has 12 gigabytes of storage, which is uh, more. It has a larger 1730 milliamp hour battery and it also has 3D recording capability. As far as pure specs, this phone has the same 1.2 gigahertz dual core processor, but it has one gigabyte of RAM. This phone is a super speed racer. We found the 3D aspect of this phone to be optimal for 3D gaming and 3D movie watching, and uh, the camera itself in 2D gave us an awesome performance. 3D was a bit gimmicky, but this is still the best 4G phone out there on the market. For all of the reviews on all of the phones that you've seen today, be sure to crab walk down to infosyncworld.com to see everything that we've written on these phones. Until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Put on that sunblock and keep it sassy.